This episode is sponsored by Honey Badger. Honey Badger has your back when it counts. They're the only air tracker that combines air monitoring, uptime monitoring, and cron monitoring into a single and simple to use platform. Their mission is to tame production and make you a better, more productive developer. Upgrading a Ruby on Rails application from one version to the next can be a fairly large task, and with the introduction of Rails 7 Alpha 2, we have seen a significant change in direction on the JavaScript assets and CSS. So in this episode, we're going to look how we can take an existing Rails 6 application that is using Webpacker, and while we won't be upgrading the Rails application from version 6 to 7 in this episode, we are going to start that process by moving over from Webpacker to ES Build. And for the sample application that we'll be moving over from Webpacker to ES Build, we will have a few different things going on. We will have a stimulus controller that is using full calendar, and we'll also have a list of posts, and specifically making sure things like the Rails UJS still works, where we get the data confirmation. And did you know that you can go to railsstore.com to get your own Ruby on Rails t-shirt or your Drift and Ruby t-shirt? To watch this full episode and more videos, visit driftandruby.com and subscribe to the Pro Membership. 